on, people? So after some quick meetings, we decided to stay open. He's like, man, this is crazy. Gotta... So we're back to work. It's Saturday. Heading to Santa Barbara. Hey, it's open. Not taking the bad boy. We're taking the little guy. We're only doing one delivery, and they told us we can only do deliveries. That's it. We cannot do anything else. No repairs. Maybe deliver the little scooters. But we got beds to deliver. I thought I was gonna get away and stay home, but they said, nope, get back to work. Let's get back to it, people. Hopefully this virus, it blows over real soon. But until then, we're gonna keep delivering these beds and uh, we'll catch you guys in Santa Barbara. Yeah, it really be like that. Everything's different now, man. Even from pumping gas, man, you don't wanna grab these things. You just grab me a towel. You don't know who's touched that thing. You don't want to touch nothing this guy's touched I don't either. Want to touch anything, hey, man. he's touching himself over there. That's nasty, man. That's how you catch the cochino virus. <laughs> I've been fucking positive. On our way to Santa Barbara, Saturday morning. They have won their freedom at last. We are fully protected, man. We are taking no kind of chances. No chances, big fella. We're not either bringing anything in or take, getting anything out, so. We gotta follow security here. Homeboy right there, he's gonna lead us to where we gotta go. In, out, and we're out. Here we are, we're gloved up. My man's gloved up. We Should gotta deliver it out here, right there. So here we have a hospital bed. So we're still allowed to deliver medical equipment until they tell us not to. Uh, we got an email saying we're okay. So we'll see how it goes and maybe we'll stop somewhere. But there's still people out and about around here, huh? Motherfuckers don't listen. listen. Motherfuckers don't listen for shit. <laughs> I hey, hope y'all die. Hey, take a shot. Take a shot challenge. <laughs> Look at me and man's here are in uh little town right before Santa Barbara. It's called Summerlin, dog. Summerlin. We uh, went to go deliver a bed over in uh, Santa Barbara. Man, fuck Check it out. Dog. Back at it again with the vandalism. I always love doing this. Grab a rock and just chuck it. Wait, you have to wait till it till it washes it out. That would be a good shot. Yeah, homeboys over there. The gym's closed, so you got homeboys over there. They're working out with bags of sand, man. Where you at with the bags of sand? Shit. In my room so it doesn't get flooded when it rains. Let's see how clean this water is. And uh, again, that's Santa Barbara over there. Those are all the oil refinery ships. Back that way is Ventura. All right, let's go. <laughs> now we have a long hike up that trail now. Fuck, man. Hey, it'll get your exercise in for the day we missed yesterday. Yeah, I'm not gonna like this. I'm gonna I'm gonna be hungry by the time we make it up there. I need some tacos, or some cheeseburgers, or some Wingstop. Or... Oh, Wingstop sounds good. Let's Hungry see what dog. let's see what we go eat.
We're on our way back home. We already finished up in Santa Barbara. This is a lookout. What is it? Lookout Beach? Mm -hmm. a little stop right here. There's a sign off the 101 that says Summerlin. That's where you want to get off. Self-service dog wash. Man, I've never seen one of these. It's pretty cool. I guess you put your dog in here. Oh, you, you just pay and you put your dog in there and you give him a shower. Put I your kid in there. Hey, hey, you can put your kid. It doesn't say you can't put your kids in there. <laughs> They're like, come on, we're gonna go take you a shower real quick. You're awful. They got a little park right here. Yeah. Oh man, it doesn't look good. What? Tsunami hazard zone, man. There's only one tsunami I know. And his first name is Johnny. 